Okay, how to format a text box in OpenOffice Writer. To do this, first make sure that you have the drawing toolbar at the bottom, uh, which we don't now, so let's uh, make it appear. You go to View, Toolbar, Select Drawing, and there you go. Uh, the big T here is for text box, so you click on that, your cursor turns into a crosshair, then you click and drag to the approximate size of your text box. You can always adjust it later let go and with your cursor you can type your text or simply paste something. Once you have your text if you want to format it you highlight it and use your breadcrumbs up here. So we'll go with uh, Arial and 26. You know my text is too long so I can readjust my box to make it fit, still too long, so I'm going to double click on the box, re-highlight my text, and just shrink it a little bit to 24. There you go. And while I'm there, I'm going to turn this into a nice blue. All right. Now the beauty of a text box is that your formatting is independent from the rest of your text. In fact, you can move it right over your text if you want. And there's also other things you can do, such as uh, putting a background. To do this, you um, once your box is activated, which means you have the blue handles here, you put your cursor on the border, right click, and then you select area. See the, the fill here, it says it's none. You can either choose color, gradient, um, hatching, which is a bunch of lines, pattern, or a bitmap which is uh, for an image but in this case we'll choose color and I'm going to choose a nice yellow there you go and I can adjust my box to the text again and I can also put a border on my, bo on my box so right click again and then I go line adjust my line. Invisible means there's no line, so if I want one I have to choose a style. In this case I'll choose continuous, black line, and make it 0.4 thick. And there you go. And something else, again, you can do with a text box is to change the orientation. So same uh, process. Highlight it, cursor on the border, right click, and we're going to select position and size and you have this window here where you can uh, select a predefined angle you can do it bit by bit or you can simply pu punch it in so I'm going to punch 45 click on OK and voila so text boxes are cool and they're very useful uh, because you can move them around and it allows you to do all kinds of things with formatting which is useful if you do a newsletter or a poster or something. So have fun doing text boxes.